Ferdinando Fairfax, 2nd Lord Fairfax of Cameron, Wikipedia Audio Ferdinando Fairfax, 2nd Lord Fairfax of Cameron MP was an English politician who sat in the House of Commons at various times between 1614 and 1648. He was a commander in the Parliamentary Army in the English Civil War. He was born in Yorkshire, the eldest son of Ellen Ask and Thomas Fairfax, 1st Lord Fairfax of Cameron, whom Charles I in 1627 created Lord Fairfax of Cameron in the Peerage of Scotland and received a military education in the Netherlands. Two of his brothers were Henry Fairfax and Charles Fairfax. Four others were killed on military service overseas. He served as member of the English Parliament for Borough Bridge during the six parliaments which met between 1614 and 1629 and also during the short parliament of 1640. In May 1640 he succeeded his father as Lord Fairfax, but being a Scottish peer he sat in the English House of Commons as one of the representatives of Yorkshire during the long parliament from 1640 until his death. He took the side of the parliament, but held moderate views and desired to maintain the peace. His main seat was Denton Hall in Wharfeedale, Yorkshire. Early Life In the First Scottish War Fairfax had commanded a regiment in the King's Army, then on the outbreak of the Civil War in 1642 he became commander of the Parliamentary Forces in Yorkshire, with Newcastle as his opponent. Hostilities began after the repudiation of a treaty of neutrality entered into by Fairfax with the Royalists. At first Fairfax met with no success. He was driven from York, where he was besieging the Royalists, to Selby, then in 1643 to Leeds, and after beating off an attack at that place he was totally defeated on June 30, 1643 at the Battle of Adwalton Moor. He escaped to Hull which he successfully defended against Newcastle from September 2 until October 11, 1643, and by means of a brilliant sally caused the siege to be raised. Fairfax was victorious at Selby on April 11, 1644, and joining the Scots, besieged York, after which he was present at the Battle of Marston Moor, where he commanded the infantry and was routed. He was subsequently, in July 1644, made Governor of York and charged with the further reduction of the county. In December 1644 he took the town of Ponte Fract, but failed to secure the castle. During his command in Yorkshire, Fairfax engaged in a paper war with Newcastle, and wrote the answer of Ferdinando, Lord Fairfax to a declaration of William, Earl of Newcastle, he also published a letter from Lord Fairfax to Robert, Earl of Essex, describing the victorious sally at Hull. Fairfax resigned his command on the passing of the self-denying ordinance, but remained a member of the Committee for the Government of Yorkshire and was appointed on July 24, 1645, steward of the manor of Ponte Fract. He died from an accident which caused gangrene in his foot on March 14, 1648 and was buried at Bolton Percy in Yorkshire. Fairfax had married twice. By his first wife, Mary, daughter of Edmund Sheffield, he had six daughters and two sons, Thomas Fairfax, who succeeded him as the third Lord Fairfax, and Charles, a colonel of horse, who was killed at Marston Moor. Political career Military service Later life <laughs>